for my everyday life and just dedicate this whole day to healthy habits and other little stuff that I can do for myself or my soul and body starting with some yoga and other than that I also made an appointment with my cosmetologist to make sure that my skin is nice and healthy and I also need to make some appointments with my doctors because I've been really procrastinating on that one and some checkups are very much due I really needed that day because I had a busy week and I've been so stressed out and as a result I've been waking up really tired like I can't even do anything during the daytime because I just have no energy so it's time to listen to my body and give it a break so this is a beautiful time thing that I've been using recently is this South Korean supplement and it's a mastic gum. If you don't know what mastic gum is, it's basically a supplement for your gut and stomach health. This one comes in the form of powder, very convenient for traveling. It's sourced from nature and known for its antioxidants and anti-inflammatory compounds. I personally have been struggling with acid reflux issues my whole life, ever since I was like probably 12 or so. And I'm not a doctor and everyone's body works differently, so just because I'm taking supplements and it works for me doesn't mean that this will work for you. And some people need more than supplements to regulate their acid reflux. And I've been prescribed medicine. I'm the type of person that would rather do anything else but to take that medicine, unless there's no other way. For me personally, taking one stick daily worked very well. And other than that, obviously I implemented some dietary changes and sleep changes. Like for example, I tried to sleep with my head put a little bit higher like with two pillows or at least make sure that the pillow is very full it's a really cool mother's day gift for a friend or a family member who wants to implement some healthy habits in their life or generally improve their stomach or gut health and now we're gonna head to my cosmetologist i love going to her she's so smart she knows everything about skincare she's the one who came up with a skincare routine for me and when i came to her first time i was like oh i want to fix this i want to fix that like skin wise i mean and she's like hold on Ruslana, you can't really fix much, it's more about maintaining and I was like, oh obviously some skin issues can be fixed but I didn't have like major skin issues I more so wanted my skin to be more lifted, more this, more that, you know and she's like, this is not about fixing it, it's about maintaining what you have and trust me, in 10 years if you keep on coming and maintaining your skin you will see the result and you'll thank me because a lot of people don't do it until it's very late that's something she taught me so yeah, let's go!
randomly stumbled upon this little garden it's so pretty and a really nice lady let me in and wow i didn't even know this exists it's a community garden that you can come to and plant something if you want to obviously you pay a small fee but it's so worth it i wish i knew about it before because i kind of lived in this area and it's so close to my previous house but i just found out Yes, every little square is owned by a certain person that pays a fee for it and they plant there whatever they want which is so cute honestly Aww. wow those are gorgeous i've never seen flowers like this before I just got ready and we're going on a date trip. I found this really cool Airbnb and it has like little goats, horses, basically like a little farm. And we're gonna shoot some content there and just generally spend a cute little day together. I always dream to live in a farm, at least for a little bit. I don't know if I'm much of a farm girl in reality, but I do like this fantasy. And a lot of times when I'm stressed out, I just imagine myself somewhere in countryside running around with ducks and it just calms me down a lot. So I decided to make this fantasy into reality and try it out, even though it's just for a photo shoot. Still, I feel like it's so exciting. Wow. This town is so beautiful. It looks almost like England. That's Dima, the photographer. Flying top down destination in California. I wanna feel the warm breeze, but I'll wait for you and see you. Cozy like a cup of tea. And I want. This is our cottage. It looks so cool inside. Let me show you. The interior is so cute. Look at this couch. I love it. Look how cute is the bathroom. Are you kidding me? Tell me this is not the cutest, coziest cottage dream house bathroom. Wow. This dress is from House of CB from their cottage core collection, which is perfect for the location. We also have this little tree house, it looks so magical. And if you want to come here, even pet animals, feed them, you can, which I think is so nice because not only you're getting this very cozy stay at farm, but you also can actually, you know, engage with animals, which for me it's like therapy. this farm so much and honestly I really want to come back here because it's so beautiful and peaceful and I want to come here and actually enjoy the place instead of like just taking pictures <laughs> 